afternoon people this is Sam South Carolina Happy Bees and we're gonna check this double deep eight frame out and we made a lot of splits off of this one but it seems like they want to have a situation now as far as what they need to do you see on the third we had a must have moved the queen out of here and put it somewhere else um, because anyway we made some splits on this one um, on the 25th of last month we let's see we had uh, some queen sales and then on the third of this month we had a new queen unmarked walking around I don't mark my queens until they've been laying for a while. It looks like the top has super frames in it. That's their food, they ain't got none. We need to do a little work on this one. These are super frames. Well, that one is. This is a brood frame. Weather must have turned bad. Eh, that's a good excuse as any. It's got not much in it, but we'll see what we can do about that. That's a honey frame. Got a little bees on it, but that's about it. It's another honey frame, nothing on it. Now the bottom looks pretty well packed from what I can see. So we're gonna take this top box off and then we're gonna set the camera so you can see down there. Might not have much in it, but it's got some weight to it. But then I was making my boxes and stuff and tops out of uh, um, so. Okay, y'all can see that too. Let's put it this way. And if y'all think I need to do these closer or further apart or whatever, let me know. Okay, we can take this one out. Yeah, we can't now. Now, now, now. This has, this is a new frame that they've just started building. And it's got some nectar in it. And they're building it to small frame so we can get get uh, worker brood. I put that in there. I didn't have my yellow markers. This one feels like it has nectar. Yep, nectar pollen. A new foundation. Got some nectar, some pollen, some bees, and new foundation. Now we need a delaying queen. Or a walking queen anyway. This one here has pollen and pollen. A little queen cup right there. Let's see. 
No, that's just a little engineer practicing. But we'll keep an eye on it. My girls are telling me it's getting late. This one here has nectar, pollen. That side there has nectar and pollen and honey. This is nectar. And here we got a little pollen. Got some honey up here and goes down there. Bees are telling me they need to get back in their hive, get the doors locked up. I don't know how the wind's going to be tomorrow. It might be pretty good. Or good for us. I mean, not blowing it 20, 30 miles an hour. And this one has pollen and nectar and On that side, this side here, we have the same thing. We have pollen. This right here is a little drone cell. We should have done been hatched, but it's probably no good. Over here is honey, and this is pollen, and this is nectar, and this is pollen up here, and then we have nectar down there. Same thing, both sides. This one has pollen, nectar, got a little honey but not much honey on it. This one over here, oops, I think I saw eggs. Okay, we have eggs, we have brood. No, we don't have no brood, we have larvae. Need to find a queen now. Yeah, but we definitely got that there. We got some here too. So we got some larvae and eggs in here on both sides. The rest, this is pollen, this is honey, this is pollen. Okay, so we got a queen in here somewhere. It's making me wonder there for a little while though. But anyway, I took the blue queen out of this one and I put it in a split, not knowing. But nobody swarmed. This is on a plastic frame, people. Y'all know what I think of them, but this has been in there forever. There's queen. Right there, beautiful queen.
I don't know if y'all can see it or not because I can't tell. We're not going to catch her. We're not going to mark her yet. Need to see some brood brood first. Okay, girls. Okay, I'll probably come back tomorrow and redo some stuff on this hive. This is where they've cut my fishing line loose for whatever reason. See, that's different from normally what I do. But that's got some nectar in it up here. And a little bit on here. This one here I crisscrossed the thing. It changed what it was to what it is, which I use in uh, 20 pound left test line and when I doubled it up like that it probably changed their from what they were used to but they'll use it you know they use that line but you see what they did to be like I say bees do what they want to They did not ask the queen about that. Okay, but that's what we're going to do with them. They had a lot of stores, but they didn't have any pollen. So we'll wait till we come back tomorrow. And uh, take care of it. Give them a little bit of pollen there. This box back up, put it back on here like it was. Put the frames in the middle. And we'll take care of that tomorrow. <clears throat> Probably going to do some, um, checkerboarding. But we'll see what we're going to do then, then put that up there we're not gonna put any food in there because they got food they just don't have anywhere for the queen to lay so we'll take care of that tomorrow we right down on here three twenty um, unmarked queen eggs and larvae and I'll check it tomorrow and we'll 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 we'll, we'll do that but we're going to take a brick it means they got a queen This one, we don't know exactly what it's got, really. It says that we was here in here on the Sabbath. In here on the Sabbath. And, uh... It says white queen eggs brewed in stores. They're eating the pollen down here and they're fighting over it too. It doesn't look like there's very much in here. Uh, 
Well, that's a frame we can look at. Nope, nothing in all this. Okay. <clears throat> Y'all have a great day. This is Sam, South Carolina. Happy bees. And we'll work on this again tomorrow. Y'all have a great day. Give us a thumbs up. Comment. Subscribe. And we thank you. Y'all have a great day. Bye.